So here's the number one Bantamweight contender making his way to the octagon. Got to be some nerves here as he gets set to compete for the UFC Bantamweight title. No denying he deserves to be there. He All right, so here he is, the consensus number one Bantamweight in the world, the UFC's reigning, defending, undisputed UFC Bantamweight champion, and he's looking for tail of the... All right, here we go. Five rounds if needed to determine the UFC bantamweight champion. Cannot wait to see how this fight plays out. Oh! Punches block. Nice body kick. That one hurt. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Effective strike there by Rivera. Good shots by the champion. And he lands a nice kick. Yeah, he's getting lit up here. He got tagged there. Oh, he's got it going tonight. Beautiful combination of strikes there by Rivera. Nice. Joe moving to his left here, trying to avoid the power in his opponent's right hand. Inside leg kick lands and immediately a mark on his opponent. Overhand left. Well, he walked into his opponent's range there and ate that hook. He was unprotected, unguarded, and he's been susceptible to that hook in previous UFC fights. Got to figure out a way to move those feet and ultimately circle out and get that head off the center line. Inside leg kick is there. Oh, beautiful head movement. Slips there. Duquesne Watt gets touched by that kick to the body. Blocks that strike. Oh! Oh, both men exchange. Oh, nice. Oh, good combination. Duquesne Watt gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. He's got the clinch. Able to check the high kick. And he connects with the punch. And he connects there, Joe. One, two. Oh, Vicious elbow one. lands to the head. Oh! Big punches here. Body kick, look at that. Just out of range with that right hand. Lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Duquesne. Oh, and he ate a front kick. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Nice punch. Beautiful combination there by Duquesne. Shot is blocked there by Rivera. Oh! Oh! Just before the horn, saved by the bell. Here we go, second round, you ready? Ready? All right, round two. This is gonna become one of those things where you're just wondering what's, what's the opponent gonna be able to do to him. Not even whether or not he's gonna win, but what's his opponent gonna be able to do to him? He's doing a really good job of timing his shots and landing a good series of strikes here. Hook to the head there by Duquesne. Well, starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Well, as we pull up the numbers there, bottom of your screen, the body strikes really tell the story in this one. That was a big focus for his camp coming in, and he has certainly worked that midsection to great effect here tonight. Couldn't agree with you more. Rivera gets absolutely melted by that head kick. And he continues to work on the inside of that lead leg. Tags and both guys really throwing with authority. Duquesne was got a bruise starting to appear on that right side of his body now. How about that shoot? Oh. Big left hand! He's got him here. Big shot! Oh.
Three minutes now to go in round two. Trying to spin to the back. Well, you got to be working off of your back. He's certainly doing so here. Nice punch. And he is back up to his feet. Oh, hook shot blocked there by Rivera. Missed on the strike attempt there. His stamina has really failed him here tonight. He's got to figure out a way to preserve some energy as this fight moves forward. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Rivera gets up again here, but he looks hurt. Good kick. Well, one got through, that kick was blocked. Oh, Put that up now. Time. Big straight punch. Oh, he caught him on the left side. Oh, nice one. He heard it. Oh, that's it. He's out. Beautiful knockout blow to finish the fight here. Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. Joe landed flush, and I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him, but for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. Let's see if we can get a better look at that from another angle. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is calling to stop for this contest at three minutes, 56 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout. And still, the undisputed UFC bantamweight champion of the world, Jimmy El Taylor Rivera. Well, that's one way to defend the belt and still the UFC